In this video we will have a quick look on how to install a proper driver for older Canon scanners like the Lide 60 on Windows 10 up to the newest versions 1909 for example or 1803. But first we have a look at the device manager and we see oh, our driver is not installed. So we close the device manager and go to the Canon website and we see there's a 64-bit driver available. It's only a Windows 7 one. We download it anyway because we need it, but we can't install it directly. What we also need is a packaging software like pzip and after that we need a twain compatible scanner software to test everything like naps 2 i already installed both of them now i'll have a look at the download directory and i'm gonna extract the downloaded driver stuff file with pzip for example or 7zip or winrar extracting an executable file is possible because this is a self extracting zip file and inside the extracted directory there's another self extracting zip file which we are also going to extract and this one contains everything including the actual driver files because of driver signature verification we cannot install them directly so we have to hold down shift when we click on restart and we will see a menu where we can restart into an advanced menu disable driver signature check since this is a windows 7 driver it's not valid for windows 10 so we have to skip it for this part this is only this only takes effect until the next reboot so we have to do all the steps we do now in this session um and when the driver is installed once it will stay in your system so we just have to do it one time in windows again we have to visit the device manager again and point to the directory where we extracted the files into and now it's possible to install the driver via device manager but in the newer windows 10 versions we, we cannot use it now we have to do another thing and this is visiting the windows root directory twain32 and there's an, a directory named with the driver's name or device internal name in my case cnql60 for the lead 60 just check what's your model name or your device folder in twain32 uh, 32 uh, directory we go to the system environment variables and paste it without the quotation marks in the list of paths just the directory path to this driver directory and now we can start our twain compatible scanner software like naps2 and it should be possible to scan i select the low setting because this is the fastest way to test this.
and here we go. Thanks for watching. Please do not throw your older Canon LED scanner away. It's a, it's still a useful piece of hardware.